good. But I wear a heart so white. What about the old man at 
What have you done? I'm afraid the worst thing you could have done was to burn that dress. The police have been asking questions. Why didn't you come tell me? Questions Why did you let me do it? Questions about your dresses. Alice, what did you tell them? Questions and more questions. Answering questions, questions, more and more questions, questions, everyday questions, questions, filling my mind with questions. Answering questions, questions, more and more questions, questions, everyday questions, questions, filling my mind with questions. What do you know? Who told you that? What's that you say?
What are you going to tell them? The truth? The truth? I want to know the truth. I saw you. I saw Miss Lizzie Borden burn that dress. Miss Lizzie, the policeman have came to speak to you. Why? I tried to keep it from you as long as possible. I begged them to let you stay here with me. Lizzie, they've come to take you to the jailhouse in Taunton until a trial date can be set. Miss Emma, the police have pulled the carriage around the front. Do you want me to have him go around the rear? No. I'm ready to go. Good people of Fall River, we thank you for your kind regards in our time of sorrow. We have this day given a $5,000 reward to be paid to anyone who may secure the arrest and convictions of a person or persons who occasioned the death of our father and his wife. Until that time, we pray that the Lord will sustain us. Out of the depths I cry to Thee, Lord, Lord, hear my voice. Let Thy ears be attentive to the voice of my prayer. My soul. Uh oh. 
Michelle Borden. I am the sister of Miss Lizzie Borden. Maybe someday we'll all forget. The name's Bridget Sullivan. I was sometimes called Maggie by Miss Emma and Miss Lizzie. Maybe someday they won't whisper, point, and stare. I am Alice Russell. But my secret's safe now. I exchanged calls with Miss Lizzie Borden regularly. She always received me upstairs. My secret's safe now. Lizzie had trouble with her stepmother that Miss Mrs. Borden thought so and so. As far as I could see, the whole thing was that one's own mother has more influence over the father. It was the father over the mother. They were young girls, but young girls could not go and do and have. Try to keep me down.
Oh, Pashaw! And Miss Lizzie laughed at the top of the stairs. Say that I'm not prepared. That I'm not dressed in black. Call me a Yankee guy to Miss Dawn. Oh, I'll imagine that. I've done my share of crying. Lord, my dues is paid. I got three more days in Toronto. I swear that I didn't say it. The reason that I say I didn't say so is because I didn't say so. And Lizzie said, I'm gonna burn the old thing up. There was nothing of that kind said. It was covered with paint. It was soiled, just as any dress would get soiled. And I said, why don't you, or something like that. I can't tell the exact word. I'm quite sure that when I left the room, I told the officer that I saw Miss Lizzie Borden burn that dress. Turn out the century. Secrets safe now. Our secrets safe now. Our secrets safe now.